bowing about a dang a dang dang a noob dig a noob a noob a noob noob a 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 noob <laughs> noob noob's that noob noob needs a job. Lamb a lamb. Wham a lamb a lamb. Noob noob's gonna die. Lamb a lamb. Uh huh. Looks like noob noob needs a ram a lamb. Damn my ling a long ding dong. I took a little bit too much ram a lamb a ding dong. My mouth isn't meant for this. Well, I am the man they what know is it meant for? Z, and this is Our Reviews Will Kill You, the review show that is uh, devoted to all things reviewish. And I am joined by my compatriots here, uh, the uh, stupendously wonderful Scott Keebler. And that was when I realized that Jesus built my hot rod. I don't remember what band that is. I just remember Ramalam Ding, my ding a dong, ding dong. And that was like real hard, heavy rock music. Ramalam Dum, my ding dong. Yeah. Ministry. Industrial. Mm hmm. Okay. And then there's uh, the choking jokester there, Noob Noob. Well, I just took my pastor in my mouth there, Lyra, so I'm a little thirsty. Your pastor? Yeah. No, no. Okay. no. What is this? The fuck? Noob, 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 noob. noob. Is this tub, like the tub. Yum Yum song? Tub, tub. Tub, tub. Tub, tub. <laughs> tub, tub. <laughs> what are you trying to tell me? What are you Expanding trying to tell me? around the waist. He's getting bigger every day. Oh, no. Tub, tub. Tub, tub. Tub, tub. Tub, tub. Tub, tub. Da, ba, da, ba, da. Tub, tub. tub. Top top, eating all the food. Top top, eating all the pastries. Top top. I don't like you anymore. You probably should slow down your alcohol and take there too, bud. Like it's you slow. just you just made that drink and it's almost empty. Yeah, it's a little <laughs> much. <laughs> at least I pick a at least I pick a glass where you can't see how much Mine's I'm intaking on a regular basis. Yeah. Yeah. Tub, tub. I totally forgot about that. Ah, <laughs> Way so to good. spring that one on me there, Scott. I don't know where that's from. So <laughs> The other song I sprung on you How do you is, not know where that is from? Why would I know where that's from? Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. You are you, Willy Wonka. Because, nerd card because he revoked. only knows the newer, not so good episodes, not the original classics. Do you want to know something? Uh, kind when, of a funny back, story? Back when it was a good movie franchise. So I remember um, when they re-released them in theaters, episodes four, five, and six, and um... Is that Star... Oh, it's Star Wars? Yeah. What? Absolutely. I, I only saw the true trilogy. That's the that's the prequels. Yeah. Remember back when they did the original three episodes four, five, and six? You know, the first, second, when and third movies. When they added all the explosions? Yeah, the first, second, and third movies, which was episodes four, five, and six of the franchise. Yeah. But then they had the celebration where all the little mini Ewok things were eating all the stormtroopers and were celebrating because they finally had a meal mm -hmm. and they were eating the people. They cooked themselves yes. up some some stormtroopers, and they were Did they show playing it? the song. Oh, yeah. that's the end song. Yeah, they, they were, showed it on camera. Them just cannibalizing stormtroopers. Well, yeah, they had they like bowls made of out of stormtrooper skulls, and they had like drums made of their heads. Yeah, they 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 were playing drums on their decapitated skulls, and they yeah. were eating them, which wasn't really uh, cannibalism because these were the little bears yeah, they're, eating they're people. bears eating people or clones, whatever they are. So I was watching the those movies when they were released. I, I I forget. I might have actually been an usher in a movie theater at that point. And that's um, funny because all I did was just recreate MC Usher paintings back oh, in the day. Okay. Ironically well, enough, I thought that that was tied together. I just remember being really drunk 
watching the end of one of these so movies. So was I when I was recreating those paintings, <laughs> which is probably why I was recreating these paintings. And I went to go lean against a trash can. <laughs> And there was nothing in the trash can. Oh, so everybody's watching this movie as I fall <laughs> as over, throwing the trash can down the stairs, all the way tumbling across the entire in that fancy red outfit, the red cap tumbling down the stairs away from you, almost slow motion, as everybody in the theater gasped. Yes, in dismay they thought they were being attacked. At what? Th- well, no, this was long before people were getting attacked in movie theaters. Back then, people just masturbated. Oh, that's well. Hard. I didn't well, see a lot yeah. of that, but P- Pee Wee Herman and you didn't um, see a lot because and you the didn't dude look down? And, the, and the dude from uh, that family show. Family uh, show? Uh, Bill was, Cosby? No, no, no. There was a family show where the the dad was caught masturbating. Mm. Mm. Ted Bundy? No, no. Not, Not sure Bundy. about that one. He was no. Nope. He was like a real wholesome good guy, and he got caught. Seventh Heaven. Spanking it. Yes. Oh, was yes. it really? Yes. It no, was it wasn't. Oh, I was a dad that show. He was like Heaven. a pastor. Did he really? Yeah, he yeah. got caught spanking in a, uh, well, it was an adult theater. It was like, well, then actually, what do you expect if someone actually goes, goes to an adult theater? Do, I don't Those think exist? They exist anymore. Yeah. Well, they used to. Well, now everybody just has phones. There was, there was a couple down in Philadelphia. Twitter porn is the best. <laughs> so what is today's show about besides uh, chub chubs yes there's chub chubs blue bloobs and russian people going gay women doing lines with the devil is an I, outrage okay. is an outrage jennifer aniston is actually a bitch we always Whoa. knew this yeah no. out of out of hand there noob, noob. bombs are going off for batwoman i don't know if it's good or bad blizzard blizzard does not like Another country, I think. <laughs> no, they no, they no. like another country a little too much. They, li- they it's like they like a little too country. too. It's like a fun uncle that's getting a little too like, handsy. I feel like I'm drinking a peanut butter blizzard right now. This is amazing. Mm. Oh my god! I mean, it's yeah. a whiskey, but still, it's amazing. Kevin Fiji, like the island, is getting a promotion. <laughs> Can we change his name officially to Kevin Fiji? <laughs> Kevin Fiji? It is. Yes. Uh, we, believe there, in, we believe in Fiji. In Fiji we trust. There is a fantastic video going around the internet that is very murdery and very Trumpy. And uh, Fantastic. Bacardi. I am incensed <clears throat> by said video. Yes, the video was quite scrumptious. And apparently you two didn't realize that Bacardi took took one of their drinks down, but I knew a while ago because I'm an alcoholic. <laughs> and uh, yeah, then we're going to do reviews of a whole lot of stuff that I didn't watch at all. There's going to be grass, primal sex, dinos, d- seeing double, El Camino. That's Spanish. Where's <laughs> J-Lo for that? Uh, and then a two-sentence horror story. Or we're just we're going to talk about two-sentence horror stories? Is we're going like to gloss over that. Is that a new bit well, or is that a show? Go, no, we're going to gloss over it in two sentences. Yeah. Oh, my God. A two-sentence review. Very apropos. I don't, I don't know. All the news for you. You heard the good news, everyone. You heard it. So apparently we're all gay because we own iPhones. God, you're gay. Exactly. Uh, a Russian man is suing Apple because an iPhone app made him gay. Anyone ever tell you what an asshole you look like? Well, he likes assholes and he likes looking at them now, <laughs> apparently. Well, what did um, he say in court? Thanks to the iPhone. Uh, this man, and I'm going to look up his name in a second, in court said, now I have a boyfriend. And I, a boyfriend, Jesus Christ, I can't words. Now I have a boyfriend, and I don't know how to explain this to my parents. That sounds like a problem. Yeah, a Russian man filed a lawsuit against Apple, claiming an iPhone app turned and him gay. His name is only... Uh, D. Razumilov. You love dead naming people, so yes. go, go right for well, that. Well, what did he do? One million rubles! Well, what did he do? Did he use the Find My Gay app? <laughs> he says know. he felt compelled to dabble with homosexuality after receiving an app payment in cryptocurrency called gay coin. Well, <laughs> don't wait, judge till wait. you try. <laughs> so, I mean, first off, how can I ju- he said, in, I thought in truth, how can I judge something without trying? I decided to try same sex relationships. Now I have a boyfriend and I do not know how to explain this to my parents. My life has been changed for the worse and will never become so, normal again. So we're going to test this out. I have my iPhone here. It's it's an iPhone X. Oh, God. Um, Scott's about to be gay. I'm going to... You're going gay? Don't annoy... No! No! Oh, oh my God. You look cute today in those jeans. Oh, my God. It works. That's what? amazing. Oh, my God. See, there's a bulge in your pants and I'd like to fill it in my mouth. Let's see Boy. if it's... Re- wait. Let's see if it's reversible. Ready? 
No, I still want that dick. <laughs> <laughs> Once you go gay, you don't change. The, I don't know so, what to say. So to that. does this mean this is going to ruin your life? You, well, uh, well, apparently for this guy, going gay ruined his life. Now he can come out of the closet and be a free noob. It's like what what what, what you jawing there, kiddo? Oh, that's a dick. Oh, oh that's a nice <laughs> dick. That's a lot yeah. of balls. That's oh. it's not it's not very big. Oh, it could be, it could be bigger. He went gay. Yep, yeah, I went gay for went pastel gay. Pink. Oh, I mean, it wasn't even for pay. He went gay for free. No, he went gay for Bitcoin. No, not Bitcoin. Gay, gay coin. Gay coin. Gay coin. Gay yes. coin. Oh, okay, well, that was. I that was probably, a crucial. <laughs> that that's another ridiculous story. Why do you keep? Why would you start with such a ridiculous? I story? I don't know if that could make you possibly gay, but doing cocaine with a devil might make you gay. Also, make you do the murders and stab your roommate thirty times. Yeah. So a student who is twenty one. I don't know why the age matters. Really, there's no reason. To, <laughs> there's no reason to stab your roommate Wait, thirty what's, times. What's the legal age for doing cocaine in this country? No legal age. Oh wow, she devil? looks intense. Oh yeah, she looks like she took it in the mouth, like willingly, because no. I one... was not doing cocaine with that chick. Oh wow, wow. So that's, her her name, I'm a name drop. That you bitch. just love dropping. I names. love dropping that's those names. Her, that's, that's Get painful. the heck out of here. Her name is not that, is it? Louisa Cutting. You Cutting? sure it's Cutting? Cutting. 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 It's Who cutting. stabbed someone Not, 30 times. It's cutting. Yes. It's cut her face. She was sentenced to 20 years in prison after admitting to killing her former friend. Why is she disparaging the devil like that? I don't know. Let's let's see here. Do not dare disparage me. Yeah, I just, should not be disparaged. <laughs> Keep your name out my mouth. Keep your name out she my mouth. She apparently flew or into a homicidal mouth. rage after taking a cocktail of drugs. Mm. She confessed to killing and she has been doing cocaine with the devil. As they arrived at the home with the victim, Alexa Cannon. I was not doing cocaine with this chick. I'll tell you right now, I have not done cocaine with anybody in at least three or four days. I, I thought you kicked that habit there, uh, devil. I did. I, I haven't. I'd like to say that I'm clean for the last four hours. She, re- wait, hold on. Reports said that she made several statements about the apocalypse, recited the Hail Mary prayer a number of times in Spanish, she also repeatedly well, tried to shove up. her entire hand Clearly inside of her mouth. Uh, she expressed some remorse, and there are no words. Scroll down. What, what is that like selfie going on there? That looks like a party. If I ever saw a party, that Lou. looks like some lesbian action. Whoa. Oh my god! Keep going down. Nope. Oh, that's nope, it. That's no the more. end of the story. Oh, no, oh, there's more. Well, first she scissored her. So and incredibly, then she scissored <laughs> her with a pair of scissors in her jugular. Wow. Um. So incredibly proud of my best friend, Louisa Cutting, for becoming Latino's Student Alliance president. I know you're going to be amazing with everything you do. Love you more. I love you so much, said Cutting. Uh, she uh, was going to be amazing with chopping her friend up. Yeah. I don't know. That seems like it came yep. out of nowhere. You sure you had nothing to do with that, Mr. Devil? I had nothing to do with it, I swear. I was not involved with that chick. You saw that face. Do you think I would ever stoop so low to hang out with like an obvious three? So, <laughs> oh my god. Oh, maybe like Jesus. A, a, a Devil. Maybe like pushing, that is rude. Pushing four on a good day maybe. So rude. Definitely not. What about so with cocaine in, her, in your system? No. Even with cocaine in my she's system. She's not like I a cocaine six? Definitely would not go. No. no. She's not like she's like, maybe like a coke five. Coke five. A heroin seven. <laughs> All right. Well, I think we're done with you, Devil. The 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 power of new new compels you. The power of new new compels you. The power of new new compels you. Oh wait, I don't think new new can compel you to do anything except no. for no. nothing. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> he's doing it again. New new's been compelled. That that iPhone works. <laughs> <laughs> that that app, the penis. That, that app is just so good. Played that D and D. That devil dick. <laughs> oh God! I um, I I I, I no, really don't always find myself at a complete loss for words. Burns like fireball, but um, tastes like I, syphilis. I, I must say, at, at this moment, um, if you're watching on YouTube, you you know why I I am in such a he was ass- assaulted moment right now. Um, you, you you just bring up the devil's name and he wants to just go for the D. I uh I I <laughs> you were you were I, I don't know what to say. Assaulted. I um. Tonight, There's a reason you. why I don't sit on that side of the room. 
I can't be anywhere near that you're, nonsense. You're, you're, in, you're in a mood tonight, bud. <laughs> just, you're, you're in just... Like, it's because he choked. It's just in a mood. I, I'm not sure what mood that it's is. It's a rare mood. What did you, you draw? You, some you sort, used the pen to erase it, dummy. Some uh, sort of a mood. I didn't know that. And why are you soaking wet? Uh, why? why are you Here, go, go draw give, whatever you're going to draw. I already drew it. Oh, I missed it. I, I don't give a shit. Watch the YouTube channel. Oh, Jesus. You're not even subscribed, are you, piece of shit? And I'm not even paying attention. I don't even look over at that side of the room. Sorry. I I might I might be moving over to your side of the room very soon. This okay. Is a lot. Yeah, that that might be better. Well, you know so what side you're not going to Yeah, you're not going to move on Jennifer Aniston's side because she's a bitch and she apparently hates Marvel. She's what is she? She's not interested in living in a green screen? Yeah, because So what? She doesn't want to smoke any weed? All that plastic surgery she got oh, doesn't go well on a green screen. That's libel, noob noob. No, she got plastic yeah, now surgery you're for just, sure. No, now you're just making libelous. She threw major shade at Marvel Cinematic Universe. How, Why? What did she say? How can you make Why? fun of somebody who's receiving the People's Icon Honor at the People's Choice Awards in 2019? Isn't she a tour de force? This is quoted from the general manager of E! News that Jennifer Aniston is a tour de force who has portrayed some of the most iconic, unforgettable, and relatable characters of art. What iconic... Name two. Um, so not Tour de France with Lance Armstrong. No, Lance Arms she's Arms not a Tour de France. So who did she play that was iconic, unforgettable, and relatable characters of our time? I can name one. She played, what's her she name was a in stripper. Friends? What's her name in Friends? She was in Friends. Is Rachel. What's her name? Rachel. Yeah, Rachel. And that's it. Wasn't she in a movie with uh, Jason Sudeikis that was kind of okay? Were the Millers? Yeah, yeah she was, was a stripper. Right. Like, she likes to show off her body. The only roles age. I know her from are ones where she got into her underwear. Leprechaun 2. She was in Leprechaun 2? Did she yes, get she in her was, underwear? So. I don't recall. Well, then that's why I the don't remember her from does, there. The Leprechaun does, though. The Leprechaun gets in her underwear. Yes. Well, I mean, good for it's, him. It's intense. You should catch this, that one. Th- that is the dumbest quote. What I other heard. movies is she... For gracefully conquering... Oh, Horrible Bosses? Okay, she was pretty good in Horrible Bosses. But, but... Are I the, wouldn't say iconic. Are these, are these the most iconic, unforgettable, and relatable characters of our time? How can she diss CGI when she's, like, never done it? Maybe she should try to slip in Her a little bit of CGI. Her body CGI, probably. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. What did she say I mean, if it is, that it's specifically good threw shade at the MCU? She she said in an interview with the former friend star, she discussed life in the movie industry before the rise of Marvel films and expressed her disdain for it. Her and, and Martin Scorsese must be bajangin. Oof. You're seeing what's available out there and it's just diminishing and di- diminishing in terms of it's big Marvel movies or things that I'm just asked to do what you are not good at reading i'm just not asked are to these do. just people who just haven't done anything interesting in the past 10 years she, so they're trying to get yeah. their marvel to make their names interesting again michelle pfeiffer's doing marvel movies and she likes it and she even said she'd be up for ant-man 3 i guarantee you if marvel came to jennifer aniston and said hey we have a role for you she would jump on that face then noob noob would jump on a penis yes angelina jolie is all over uh she's all over the mcu she's now all she's over in the eternals it. They gotta so. do a Mr. and Mrs. Smith MCU version. Get them, get that crew back together. Brad, I don't, Brad I don't Pitt. know. Brad Pitt would he do a MCU movie? I don't know. I don't know. He's gorgeous. D- d- yeah. Though. Well, he's going through a divorce, so yes. Anything, <laughs> he needs that anything money. that gets him paid, he's he got the money. Absolutely, is going to do. He's got the monies, though. Mm, he might um, need more money. He's getting divorced from Angelina Jolie. He lost all the monies. He needs more money. He definitely Doesn't needs need more money. That many more monies. He just Everyone did a great movie money. called Ad Astra that nobody saw in the Don't entire US. Don't you need US. more monies? I always need more money. Everybody Everyone needs, needs more, more monies. monies. But Brad Pitt has Jinx. monies in his Yanks. gorgeous abs. I love okay. it. I love Brad so Pitt. next. So I don't care about Jennifer Aniston. Anyway. After I think what was it last episode that we talked about how great and fantastic and just one of the best new shows of this century, possibly, is Batwoman with Ruby Rose. Uh, there is news that there is review bombing going on. That's not okay. That's not okay. It's not okay. It's not okay at all. We need... It's not okay. I'm going to go to IMDb. No, it's not IMDb. Not I'm going to go Rotten Tomatoes. Because this Isn't is a this, rotten... Is this the kind of review bombing that happened to um, that Captain every, Marvel? Every, every John Travolta movie? 
Everybody that, hates John Travolta. That made it zero percent. Yeah. Why would they hate John Travolta though? Like, you just think it's trolls, or do you think it's active? That's a good point, right? Because a lot of people are saying that these are like incel, like uh, you know, people who are involuntarily not having sex, like giant nerds who are angry at women. Like most trolls do. I mean, yeah. Show me a. Tr- but show are they me, trolling show me somebody who's had sex, and I'll show you somebody who's not a troll. So, but but the point is, if the, if you're right, because they may have reviewed bombed John Travolta too why are they after John Travolta or are they just trolls because they're assholes or are they genuinely do they have an agenda I guess that's the question depends some of them sometimes it's the agenda we last last week we talked about the OK symbol and it was um, the website 4chan which is all trolls all the time all trolls had an agenda which took away the OK symbol sometimes there's an agenda other times it's just virgins covered in acne sitting in their mom's basement eating Fritos who've got nothing better to do because they can't even find their own cocks I mean, they're so it depends fat. on the day of the week, though. Yeah, we talk about TV shows all the time on Rotten Tomatoes not having any reviews, right? And we're like, oh, we're the eighth reviewer or we're the tenth reviewer. Batwoman has 40 critic ratings at 70%. <clears throat> 5,473 reviews at 12%. 12. And I can and tell th- you... I'm sure they are all awful. Like, they're just not good, trying way too hard. Hey, shouldn't they get two stars at least for trying? <clears throat> I, that- I, I tell you right now, I watched episode two, and 12% is very accurate. Oh! <laughs> so you're joining the incels? Ho- no, I'm being honest. You the show sucks. No go- yeah, but is it a one star? No. Or a half okay. or zero no, stars? I'll give it two stars. Okay, so most of these are like three. two to zero no, stars. not even close. It's the worst. It's it's one of these horrible shows where the writing is completely lost. The acting is absolutely horrible. Let's Things see some happen of these for reviews. no reason. Keep going. It's, Let's see. It's stupid. It's stupid. What is the point of trashing Batman? Just like the rest of them. Huh? Keep, where's all the bad reviews? These are all good ones. Keep these going. Are... See all audience reviews. I just want to see this what is it a is. Lot, a lot of effort here. I so hard to click for you. I know. Keep going down. Nope. Oh, go. God. Yeah, yeah. I already read those two, dummy. God damn it. You are so bad oh at this. Oh, my God. Really Ooh, pathetic. Half a star. This Looks show, like they destroyed well, the comic this one's book horrible. industry. This, this show belongs in the bottom of the ocean just like Ruby Rose because she likes to eat fish. What, what the that's, fuck? That's, a that's disgusting, an awesome. Why do I even say that? review. Scott, oh, half a star? A, a, Wait, this one. I love the story writing. Almost every DC show has had a great intro and straight stay true to the comics. I can't read the rest because there's a thing in the way. This show stinks more than Ruby Rose's mouth after she goes out on a date. Jesus! Oh my God. Horrible! Jesus! <laughs> so you That's just horrible! Hate, do you hate Australian Why? Women? Why Scott. would somebody write that review? That's disgusting. Oh my God. It's that on is, the screen. It's, that's it's Scott's review own on the review. He is that's Scott's what you're talking personal about. review. That was fully Can on the screen more right there. Here? It should, this show should get a, a two stars just for it. It spawns a drinking game because it every does? episode... There's at least one to five times Ruby Rose falls back into her Australian oh, accent. Oh, that would be a great drinking game. Every time she mangles the English language. How about English language? <laughs> how about how about every time we every language she, don't English language? Mangles the English language. How about every time we language don't English language? <laughs> how about every time she takes off the back cow and her hair is absolutely perfect? She's she perfect. has short hair. What are you yeah, talking about? No, dude. no. When you take what do you mean no? When she you doesn't take have off short the back, hair? Yeah, she has short hair. She should be sweaty and poofed, a mess. It's poofed <laughs> and flowing just and look perfect. Like, just look like she got yeah. dicked hard every time. Oh, well, she's, she's not, not taking her. any dick. She's not disheveled, taking any scissoring hard. Just disheveled, confused. She a little sa- disheveled, a confused. little sour about what look, just happened. Look, wait. Here's here's a three star review. I tried to split this show like Ruby Rose split her last girlfriend. Oh and my I god. Am severely. T- <laughs> wow. Wait a Scott, second. Scott. That, oh review, my that review. That makes no sense. All of these reviews you just keep <laughs> making up. That makes no sense. Oh jeez. That should just say Scott K says. All right, so is it fair? I don't think it's fair, though. That's not true at all, Noob Noob. I love, <laughs> I love lesbians. I am, I am a lesbian, in fact. Scott is, in fact, a luscious I lesbian. I am a lesbian. Luscious lesbian. 
You have the thickest beard of any lesbian I I've love, seen. I love how we're doing an audio podcast and Dickhead over here is writing on a board. I, I know we're now on YouTube and doing videos and stuff like this, but you really have to find a balance. Yeah, you, you have to understand. You why are my things running out? I can't what? understand that video. Scott loves scissoring, not lesbians. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what? Why do you just write things? I don't know. So stupid. So stupid. Not even. Legible. We need more markers. Also, this kind of looks like I'm jerking off, doesn't it? Yes, it does. <laughs> yes, it does. Okay. I think I'll do a pan <clears throat> down. <laughs> anyway. So I, I'm just saying. I, I don't think it's fair. No, it's an okay show. It's, it's not, not great. It's not it's bad. Not, it's horrible. Is it a what? Like you said, if it, it's it does it deserve five thousand bad reviews? No, that's a little excessive. Yeah. That sounds like I don't think 5,000 people didn't watch this show. That's probably also a good point. So maybe you're right. All right. Next. So Blizzard is a massive gaming company that now owns uh, Activision. uh, All the Starcraft games. You mean the other way around. Doesn't Activision own Blizzard? I've heard it both ways. Um, So anyway. What games does Blizzard own? I don't ask me these follow Diablo questions. 3. Dibolo 3. World of Warcraft. Starcraft. Starcraft. Um, Overwatch. You may have heard of these games. World of Warcraft. Very um, large company. Yes. And apparently they love China. Um, and so much so that they're canceling their shit. So not, not China shit. Just their You're shit. You're canceling China? I didn't know. I know no we're part of the cancel China. culture, Good but luck nobody can cancel, cancel China. China. No. So Blizzard cancels Nintendo Switch Overwatch event in their Nintendo New York worldwide store. Why so did they do that? Why, why did they do that? Let's let's read and see. Does this have anything to do with like all the people getting fired or blocked or anything else because they're part of the China protest or something? Yes. So several Overwatch players as well as... Um, What's that other? Hearthstone. Actually, I think there's the Hearthstone. Hearthstone. Hearthstone World Series going on. And the um, some of the, the really good contestants or the highly paid players, whatever you want to call them, have been holding up signs and protesting that Blizzard is is uh, supporting censorship in China and not supporting the the free Hong Kong things. There's been a, a lot of So we're saying we cannot have Hong Kong be free. No, we support China. Please pay us money, China. We love you. Socialist, long time. We we'll definitely have more videos blocked in China than anywhere else. Oh, my God. Who, we, we do? Love yeah, China. We do. I do love really? egg rolls. No, we have one episode blocked, and it's the one that we I talked about. I thought it was blocked in Japan. What's his name? Oh, yeah, Japan, Japan is not China. You're right. General So <laughs> Chicken? Those are two different countries. I love that I'm, I'm, shit. Hor- I'm horrible at geology. Ge- I, mean, I, <laughs> I just sorry. don't know anything about gems. I don't gems. know anything about them. Nothing about gems. About... about the I maps. I don't know anything about landmass. <laughs> you know about mass, but not landmass. Not landmass. <laughs> so uh, geopolitical politics happens to be uh, Z's specialty over here. Yeah, but and he loves only, LeBron. Only, and poli- his... only political I don't, politics. I love LeBron. That sounds kind of redundant. Political politics? Political politics. Well, I will tell you that there have Political been... Political politics, politically speaking. Many, many protests uh, in Hong Kong over the current situation where they are a semi-autonomous state, but they are owned by China. They've had their run of democracy, but China is slowly um, you know, trying to exert their will because they do own that, that particular piece of land. And uh, China is great. All hail China. We love you. I think I'm long, going poten- I'm going to potentially protest your perpetual perpetration of political politicaltude of... Are you going to tickle uh, Noob Noob's taint? He already did mine. Well... There you go. I I, I feel violated. This is hitting me hard uh, right now, boys. Blizzard's Apparently. been canceling a bunch of things because there's a bunch of protests. The NBA's been having problems with China as well. They've been getting canceled. See, that's the ultimate cancel culture. We we complain about cancel culture here in the U.S., but in China, they will literally erase it's, who it's, you are. It's censored. The internet is censored. You can only get certain things. Yeah, they pulled you. all of the NBA's gear off the shelf. You cannot buy NBA gear right now yeah, because... And, and you will get disappeared. If you piss off yes. the wrong people, you will disappear. We, we love you, China. Do not disappear us. <clears throat> they can't. We're in the States. They have to go hey. all the way. They have to get past. They have to get. Past they have to get past Noob Noob Kansas first. <laughs> yeah, like, you have to get past Kansas and skip I just, over. I just picked a, a middle state in the we country. We are absolutely based out of Wichita. Yes, 
Come to come find us in Wichita. Come find we'll us. We'll meet you there. Maybe we're even in um, Kansas City. Yes, come find us in magical Wisconsin, Idaho, where Orq is recorded in the cornfields of magical Kentucky. <laughs> yeah, all right, next. So yeah, next, uh, Kevin uh, Fiji, uh, like the island. Kevin he, Fiji. Fiji. We're officially changing his name instead of Kevin Feige or it's Kevin Fiji. It's Kevin Fiji, like the water, over expensive and tastes delicious. Delicious. Yeah. So and he, worth every penny. That's well, the only water I'll drink. No, that dude worth is worth penny. billions of dollars. He's, He's worth billions literally of dollars. the the Hollywood's version of version of King Midas. Fiji is the only water I'll drink because this is America. Damn it. That doesn't make sense. Not at all. And nope. I'm allowed. And it's my freedom. Because you prefer to drink that over Flint, uh, Michigan water. Yes. yes. <laughs> because <laughs> that's a resounding. The guess. drinks. The drinks <laughs> that I indulge in are way more flammable than Flint's water. Oh. So okay, that happened. Anyway, so Marvel Studios chief Kevin Feige got a promotion. Feige, it's not Feige. Fiji. 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 Feige, Fiji, Feige, G, B, B, B. Fiji. Anyway, yeah. So he got a promotion, and he now has creative control over everything, not just the MCU. Fucking everything Marvel does. Yes, that sounds like an excellent idea. It does sound. Yes, like a- that's a fucking excellent idea. Oh my god, it's like you just played the clip twice. That was. Such I know, a great- right? Isn't yeah. it just amazing? No, it's not like. I any- love Fiji. No, it's not like anyone could do that. No, um, I know. Just, Jesus. Just, it's, it's real talent. Uh, like, only like, I don't know. It sounds like someone that could be in a band might know, be able so to much, do that. So but that person who just did room. that was just so shitty. Like, it's not like they could actually sing. Anyway, um, so anyway, Kevin Fiji was... Uh, noob, noob. Uh, noob, noob! Okay. He has creative control over everything. He's the chief... What is he? Chief financial officer? Chief... Chief CFO. suck a dick! Chief, so, okay. He's the C, he's the CFO, CFO, CEO, CIO, CEG, CRO, and OPP. No, he he's Down the with CCO, OPP. the Chief Creative Officer. He creates and he officiates his creating. So he's a, okay. Long story short, since Noob Noob can't seem to spit out a story, no, is that he is in control of not only the Marvel MCU but TV. And cartoons and animation, everything. He's Even like the dominatrix of the MCU. I create and officiate. Or he's the decider of all things Marvel. Higher production. Or he's he got the whip and the Disney doesn't have a safe word. He is the decider. He has overall creative control of all Marvel storytelling. That's power right there. That is power. I mean, you think you think that like the the president of this country, the generals, dictators, mafiosos, people you think that actually have power don't have power. Not compared but to Fiji. Fiji has power. So, Real power. Do you think that this this is a ploy somehow to keep him out of Star Wars, or does this like it's that seems like weird that they'd say they wanted him to help produce something in Star Wars, and then they're like, yay! We're gonna give you a promotion, and we want you to stay here forever. We're I thought pay- he already had full control over everything MCU. No, the Marvel Cinematic Universe, nothing else. Oh, so they're giving him everything. TV, the the whole kit and caboodle. Why? Because Marvel. the TV is losing money. Because the TV is horrible. Yeah, because they split parts of it on like Hulu, and no one so, watches that. So garbage. if they give it all to him under one person, which actually would make sense for anything that you're doing whether it was kevin or not it would probably be a better well they screwed up those netflix shows they finally fixed them when they put out punisher and they put out uh, the new season of daredevil and then netflix is like yeah so they negotiated an awful yeah, contract except, with well, netflix. Except netflix already pulled the plug long before the last season of daredevil and punisher happened anyway well so i don't think fiji course, would have it was negotiated too, little, too late i don't think fiji would have negotiated such a bad contract he, he, pro- he also wouldn't have let those shows get to the shit show they were say show again yeah. scott um, show say show Show. Jessica, show. Jessica, show. Jessica Jones and Nobody Iron Fist would Jones. not have that bad, and people would have cared if Don't they were under Iron the Fist. Fiji flag. Jessica Jones should have been Iron Fisted. I, I, I mean, I should have been Iron Fisted. I saw that video. It was impressive. Oh my god! Mm. Actually, 
So can we move on from Fiji water? Yeah, let's move on. Uh, So apparently, Bacardi has, uh, this is about a year ago. As uh, two (laughs) long-standing alcoholics, um, Scott Scott. and I, (laughs) were shocked (laughs) to find out that 151 no longer exists. Bacardi 151. Oh my God. I am shocked and appalled. <laughs> you fell all the way down into your basement. Holy oh my cow! God, no, I, I'm. Sh- I would. I would feel like I was literally raised on 151. That was like one of the first alcohols I ever drank. That's the first one I ever lit on fire. I absolutely. Isn't that just yes. ethanol? No, it's, no, it's no, Bacardi that's, uh, 151. Everclear is basically ethanol. 151, yeah. though, that was you would take shots of 151 to prove that you were capable of drinking. Yeah. Your friends under the table. At, or even just out. drinking. No, no. That, that depends. Bl- Isn't the fucking blackout thing juice. 151 proof? Early? Yeah, but it's not yeah. like... Uh, it's weird because people call Fireball blackout juice because it's like really... 151 was like... No, no. Fireball, Fireball's blackout juice because of what guys put in it before they hand it oh, to the girls. That's I why gotcha. Fireball is blackout juice because but it's... But I truly dating. grew up on 151. Oh, and yeah, it is absolutely. a sad day. I feel like I... In Gatorade, you drop it, you, you put 151 in the Gatorade bottles, you take it to the sporting events. It was amazing. I remember I had, um, what do they call that when you oversize a, a, a McDonald's drink? Supersize. 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 I, I supersized my, my, uh, my Coke with 151, mm-hmm. and that was not a good idea. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hell yeah. I was, uh, I was feeling that for years. Hell yeah. So, and flaming shots. So apparently, uh, Bacardi got tired of being sued for all the flaming shots that people were taking. That or, must have been or it. Or bartenders spitting out flaming fireballs. So. There's, I mean, there's other liquors out there that'll light on fire, but 151, yeah, but 151 was the original. It was, it's part of my heritage. It is. It's because I mean, you're just, an alcoholic. Just pouring. Mon- one, I, I racially identify as an alcoholic. Pouring, that, pouring, is that pouring, a race? Pouring 151, Absolutely. Pouring 151 into my Coke and taking it to class. I mean, come on. Did you do that? Yeah. Did oh, really for sure. Yeah. Are you, you kidding, kidding me? Who the fuck does that? I'm a respectable Catholic boy. I don't do that shit. What are you this talking about? School. I love Jesus. Oh, my God. Who do you think gave it to me? Jesus. Did Jesus give it to you in your mouth? I called it Jesus juice. Dude, I was oh pretty sure. Yeah. Jesus juice. You I, drank it and you saw Jesus? It was the nun who gave me the 151. Did you swallow Jesus <laughs> in your mouth? Was it Korean Jesus or just regular Jesus? Just regular Jesus. Oh, okay. I'd see Korean Jesus. Ah, uh, yes. That's right. Just, well, because you, you were in a special school. What? Is there different Jesuses? Yeah. Like, you know how, is There's the plural black Jesus. of Jesus, Jesus? No, 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 Because no, any no. word that has an S on the end is not actually Jesus. Jesus is what you make of him. No, he's Jesus. No, 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 it's Jesus. You make Jesus into whatever you want. Jesus, 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 like Jesus. Levi jeans. Jesus, Jesus is like manatee. It's one or plural. It's all of the above. M- manatee yes. or manatee? No, <laughs> it's all of the above. It's manatees. Jesus, Jesus is what you make of him or her. If you, if you get drunk enough to see Korean Jesus, that's one level. If you see she Jesus, that's another level. Yeah, if you see Mexican Jesus, you go way too far. Yes. And then gone. if you have an iPhone and you drink Bacardi 151, then you definitely will go gay. Ready? Tap. I've been gay. What that doesn't really <laughs> It mean. still didn't change him. Oh my god, Scott, you look less at no, no I'm wait, kidding. You're my phone's gay now. I thought oh, shit. <laughs> I thought you were gonna bury yourself in his beard. You stay beard away. to beard. You don't you encourage him. <laughs> Beardening. I'm the, I don't want any more. Don't encourage him. Alright. Next. Yes. So there is a video going around. Beautifully animated, terribly delicious. Oh plenty Jesus. of plenty entertaining. And it is of uh, Scott, Trump. did you see this? Yes, it is of Trump. I asked Probably Scott not. a question. The no. one, the only, the Trump. I'm not sure. The Trumpinator? Yes, the Trumpinator. Trumpinator. <laughs> um, People are getting their panties and mm. their britches about this one. If anyone has watched Kingsman, the original, there is a scene in that movie where Colin Firth goes full-on murder in a church. Of, like, racists or something. Of, he just uh, kills um, everybody. No, 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 no. They were just extremists. Did you see that, or were though? Were they racist? Right? They were like supposed to be some sort of uh, West Bap- 
Just, oh yeah, yeah, they, yeah, yeah. It was yeah, it was racist against every race. They were just okay, yeah. ridiculous. Yeah, they were extremists. So essentially, someone took the clip from that old ass movie from like I don't know six years ago or something, and they superimposed Trump's face on it and <laughs> so had him said killing Trump murdering everybody. He just ki- he kills CNN. Obama and Obama oh, so, oh, and so, Hillary. Oh, so and they're also Kathy doing Griffin. all the other p- heads. They're pasting like yes. So someone took a lot of time for this. Mitt Romney. It is mildly amusing. It's but not more. It's more than mildly amusing. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't understand someone, why are p- people wanted Trump to apologize put for a it. lot of effort. He into didn't this. make it. I don't think they put that much effort to it. If into it, if you see it, but it is pretty classic. But people are asking for Trump to apologize. Yes, did for Trump, a video he did not make. Did Trump share it? That's a, actually, I think he did. <laughs> <laughs> well, He's such that, a that and that is what makes him an idiot. Oh, <laughs> uh, yes. He should. He, in fact, I'm pretty sure that Trump was trying to take credit for it. But Fuck it. That's a great video. It. I'd take credit for it, too. No, Ryan that makes Trump, that, that, Wait, hold on. That's not my take, Trump voice. You can take credit for it as long as you're not the president the of the fucking United States of America. This video is huge. It's so great. I'm the huge. greatest of all video editing people ever. I made this video. It's amazing. It's the bestest I've ever seen. I mess. You are fake to news. My own oh, yeah, it's and fake own news greatness. media, and it, and they like, they go to visit the church of fake news. Oh, that's pretty oh, good. God. If only Trump Zilla were here to tell us about it. The best was that. <laughs> I don't feel the, like uh, it. Fucking <laughs> the faces. What do you mean? Don't feel like it? Trump Zilla. I've, I've had it. Trump Zilla. I, I don't even want to talk about this fucking guy. What, what about Trump Zilla? Just exhausted. What about the Meg? <laughs> oh, for some can we find McNuggets? anyone racist to this talk is, about this? this? Is another that's another country altogether. How can the ra- how can we didn't have anybody that's racist talk about the Mexican country joker all together? Oh, good Jesus. It's the wrong country. So I don't know. People are very upset about this video, and um, I am highly triggered and offended. And Noob Noob loves it. So yes. So um, ah, Trumpzilla, have you come to visit us? To get by without talking to me. How's that space you wall thought, coming? You thought it was possible to go without talking to me for more than five minutes. I how, feel like it's been how many you, episodes. How can you not talk about me all the time? I'm the greatest of all time. Trumpzilla, I, I wonder, how come you didn't come and visit us when we had Jennifer Lopez here in studio? What? Are you telling me that you had an illegal here in this studio? Oh my this, god. This, what the fuck? I'm pretty why, sure Jennifer Lopez this is, is why she's I've Jenny not from been the block. Here. She she's from was Brooklyn. Not Jenny. the C block, yeah, not prison. This is not why the prison I have block. To spend no. so much time creating walls and building walls is because you people are allowing these people. Of These people the are you say are you saying that we're 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 cucks and we're part I'm of the you're part of the problem. We're Admitency, part of the fake news? Admittedly, you're part of the problem. You're part of the fake news. You're making things up. You're saying things that aren't true. But all I was saying is I was I was wondering why you didn't come visit us while J Lo was on it. And I, I was, was busy in space with Mothlania space Trump making Moth- a wall. <laughs> To keep out the legal aliens. I forgot about Mecha Mothlania. Trumpzilla. Trumpzilla Mothlania. Oh, I totally Christ. forgot about that. I will create. What the Mega fuck Trump. is going on? I will create Mecha Trump to keep our borders <laughs> safe. What? Mecha Trump. Oh, if I don't I condone need this. A from I'm not a part of this. I'm not a part of this. This video, I'm in. Mechanicalized. I'm not racist. Trump. It will be. A, nope. It will be a robotic I love, I love, Trump. I love all the colors. With I real hair. Like colors. It's real oh, hair. Like if anything, I don't fake. like white. Not a wig. I'm it white. I don't like myself. All right, w- all right, Trumps. Though when you when you bring bring us Mecha Trump next time, and we'll talk to Mecha Trump. Not Mexican bring him Trump. With you. What about Mexican Trump? <laughs> no, already. not Mexican Trump. We're talking about Mecha Trump. All that, I can say is I'm that already here. No. <laughs> All I thought you had to finish the wall before you finished Mecha Trump. Oh my god. I am Mecha Trump. What I the fuck? The wall. Nope. Because I am a machine. This is not cool. I am perfect. We're I getting okay. The wall. You are the you are Trump in perfection? I am Trump in perfection. Me too. I am Mecha Trump. <laughs> wow. No. All I can say is that that I can meet you to perfection because I am a robot. So and you will make hay of no flaws. I will make get- everybody need to. Okay. 
<laughs> that's cool. You've already just, you, you, you know the outcomes of everything that's going to happen. Cool. I will cool. eliminate the flaw that is the human Sh race. Nope. <laughs> You're going to keep going. What the fuck did you just say? He's, uh, Becca, Trump is going to eliminate the human race. Now oh. we know. Now we know what Trumpzilla's goals are. So he's we an anti-humanist. Him and Donnie. Oh, oh, fucking the Donnie. The Don Don. Anti-humanist. The Don cast. One and done. One and done. I will, yeah. I will eliminate the virus that is the human race. <laughs> Much like sex with Donnie, he did one podcast. <laughs> one podcast and quit. Still, still massacring hit it, the English language. Hit it and quit it. In yes. the English language. English uh, language. Wow. Okay. Wow, wow, wow. Um, <laughs> wow. Okay. Should we move on to reviews? <laughs> Let's just do Should it. Should we? Let's just review. That's fantastic. Well, well, hold on. No. No. Shut that shit off. Before we do reviews, let me ask our listeners something. Are you a good... No. Nope. Well, we have breaking news here. Breaking, breaking news, news have in the field. We have breaking I'm news. Speaking. Noob Noob has a sponsor to go to. Let's listen in to Noob Noob. I do. So before we do reviews, let me ask our listeners something. Are you a god, a ghost, or a sexually obligated goblin to have sex with Noob Noob? Regardless of your answer, you're going to want to check out Gods and Ghosts Clothing Company. Clothing that is designed, picked for quality, printed for by people just like you. Gods and Ghosts Clothing has the style you are looking for with all the comfort you want because it was picked by the people who want to wear it. No outside designers, no outside fulfillment companies, no mass production, just a blue collar mentality built to bridge the gap between blue, white, and pink collars. Whoever you are, whatever your story, Gods and Ghosts is your brand. Check out, check the, check them out at gngclothingco.com. That is gngclothingco.com. Is that gng with like an ampersand or g? &G? No, g like as an n, like a hard n. G oh, clothing G -G. co. Yes, that thing. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Just to be clear, and our fellow hey, orcs, ampersand. it is the nope. letter n. Ampersand. Okay. Gng. Yes, the letters. In the alphabeticals. Okay. And our fellow orcs, if you're a Gods and Ghost clothing website, you can use our special orc you discount code. We don't have listeners, so that's not going to get used. You get 10% you sure? off your Are order. You sure? Because that's right. Are different. That's right. You get a discount code of O-R-K-U when you go to G-N-G clothing C-O dot com and save on your orders of Gods and, Gloth Gods and Ghost clothing. So just just do it because Scott will suck dick for clicks. Oh, um, Jesus. Yes, Scott will Jesus. whore himself out. He shaved his beard just, just so a woman would touch assuming him. Assuming things. Out no, that's just, factual. Just horrible. You. She was like, Jesus. "Oh my God, your beard is bigger than your penis," and then you're like, "Okay, let me fix that," Holy and Jesus. then you shaved your beard. Oh, that is not a hundred percent factual. <laughs> Are review the views. Why is that one not working? There we go. Reviews. There it is. So there, no, that's not. That's reviews. not reviews. I don't know what this is. Where's my paper? Reviews tonight. Reviews. How is that good news? Oh, How it's not, not that one. <laughs> Jesus, Scott. What the fuck? Jesus. So we're going to do w uh, rapid fire reviews, reviews. because we reviews. spent reviews. way reviews. too much reviews. time reviews. talking reviews. about new Holy shit. Jesus. About the news? Stop doing stuff. Uh, noob so noobs nudes. Great. Noob nudes. Okay. Noob nudes. Noob, noob lube. Noob 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 lube. Is, actually, this noob is a new dudes. website I've been working on, and we're calling it Noob Noobs. I okay. actually have been planting cameras in various places around New Noob's house without his knowledge. <laughs> oh, that sounds that's like a bad. great reality show. Yes. And we're going to be calling it Nude Noobs. Nude There's a noobs. whole lot of masturbation. <laughs> in every room and in the house. that's it. Every literally room. every room. He's literally painted every And room. I haven't cleaned in weeks. <laughs> so, oh, it's, fuck. It's this on is the, not it's good. on the ceilings. Great. So the first one is a Netflix exclusive. I think so, Exclusive. Right? Exclusive. 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 In the Tall Grass, which is a sequel to uh, Corn on the Cob. <laughs> <laughs> Corn on the Cob? Yes, Corn on the Cob by Stephen King. <laughs> uh, so the critic consensus, a potentially intriguing premise, is rapidly lost in the weeds during In the Tall Grass, which struggles to stretch its slim source material to feature length. This was a horrible follow-up to Field of Dreams. 
absolutely horrible. Yes. I, I did not feel uplifted after this. Tomato meter, 36%. Total reviews, 61. Audience score, even worse, at 27%, but only 41 reviews. <laughs> Uh, so it's actually a short story written by Stephen King and Joe Smith. Is it Joe Smith? His, uh, his son. Look at the writers. I need to see that real quick. Or just do nothing. Joe or Hill? Just look at your phone. Joe Hill. That's right. Joe, Joe Hill. Hill. Yeah, because I just know that shit. I'm not even looking. Wow. Dog. Wow. Woof, woof, woof. Wow. wow so, wow, wow, wow. yeah, there's dead dogs in this, so you probably won't watch it. Is it really? Yes. I'm not watching that. Why yeah, would dead I dogs. Dead dogs. Uh, it's a little too long. It's not very Don't well do it. acted. I'm going to do it. Uh, Don't do it. I'm going to do it. Don't do Can it. You, hold on. Nope. Don't you have... No! Oh. I, I had a special ending for that dog. That's not allowed in this country, see. Really? Yeah. Only in China. I was going to feed it something special. Oh, oh, I thought you were going to do something else. Something that takes a little bit of time. It's a little oh, juicy, yeah. though. I don't know where it is. Oh, well, fine. Forget <laughs> you. Wait, I just found it. <laughs> it sounds like the last We need on. another What's marker, by really the way. Weird. This is like, I can't. Oh. Hey, can't doggy, I have a treat for you. Oof. No, nope, fuck it. Uh, oh, my God. How do you have another one? So, yeah, it, the cinematography is okay. I've never seen grass like this. It, it's essentially, to me, kind of the uh, spiritually connected to children in the corn. So, wait, if, is this actually about grass? It is about grass. It's, it, and grass people. It's a movie about growing grass. grass. Uh, I wish it was a movie about smoking grass, but it's not. So That is unfortunate. Okay, well, that's something that Noob Noob put up, and that is not even worth saying because it's not even that funny. No. So anyway, uh, yeah, you could probably skip this one. It's not as good as 1927. Clearly, they're going to make every single thing that Stephen, Sk- uh, Stephen King wiped Stephen his Sting? ass with. Anything that Stephen King wiped his ass with, they're going to make a film of. Just like Fucking they're going to make a film sucks. of... Uh, what's that? Uh, the, se- the, sequel the sequel to The, to the Shining. Shining. Yes. Really? Really? Did he actually write that book? Dr. Sleep? I think he did. So that's an actual, that is an actual Stephen King book. I, st- I guess so. Is that, but is it It a looks book? like crap. Is it a book he wrote after the movie when he's like, I'm going to get every dime I can out of this bitch? Well, he hates the, uh, the, the Stanley Kubrick movie, so I don't know. I don't know. So is it I'd worth say skip watching? it. Yeah, no, skip, skip it. it. So another one that I did not watch, it's an Adult Swim exclusive, oh. Primal. There's a lot of dino action. Oh, dinos. Yes. If you've ever wanted to see cavemen um, and dinosaurs and death and murder and not a lot of talking, this is your show. You need to watch it. It's amazing. It is um, made by the director. What's his name? Gendi. Gendi Tartakovsky. Gendi Tartakovsky. Tartakovsky. Who also? Tartakovsky. He he also directed um, not Simple Jack, but uh, Simple Jack. Samurai Jack. <laughs> Simple Ricks. Yes. You want to taste the greatness of your own completion? Take a taste of of Simple Ricks. Of Simple Jack. I mean, um, so, dude, and this was awesome. It's five episodes. It's uh, visceral. It's dope. There's dinosaurs and humans fighting dinosaurs. Do the dinosaurs live happily ever after? I can't tell you about that. It's ultra violent. Can you give me the... We're not doing spoilers. Can we do the... uh, There's not much to spoil, but... Uh, it's a hundred percent on tomato meter under it's the critics. It's from eleven people. Calm down. Ninety-eight yeah. percent for that the audience. Seems, Forty-eight people. Calm that's, down. That that's seems more a lot than more what honest. Yeah. That seems a lot more honest than the five thousand people that other movie got. We have more reviews on iTunes than this show there, does. There's more than f- there's. Uh, the audience score. The only like we said, there's forty-eight reviewers on this. Batwoman got five thousand reviews. That and seems is it ridiculous. Two percent. Yeah, it's ridiculous. I highly recommend Primal. It is awesome. I would definitely check that out. For sure. God damn, we have a lot of episode to go through. We do have a lot of episode. Um, All right, so fast this, forward. 
No, we're not fast forwarding. This is a this is a key. Oh my god, this is a bad score. This is a key this is moment. Wow, jeez, yes. whoa, I, that's a crazy disparity. That's insane. Yes. So but it this, bombed at the theater. Especially theaters, for so. a Will Smith movie. It yes. bombed hard, though. Who loves Will Smith? I love Will Smith. It made, what, $20 million is in its opening? It was... $20.6 um, million. It was an expensive movie, though. Let me see what the fucking budget of this shit was. I would be was. curious. Yeah. Uh, it's, bo- it's not So what's the movie much, you're talking about? Gemini it, Man? It is Gemini Man, directed by Ang Lee. The same man who brought you uh, Life Smoking of Dragon, Dragon Tigers. Life of Pi and Hulk in 2003. Dancing Tigers, Smelly Dragon. Wait, which Hulk so was that? Was that the, the Edward Norton Hulk? No, or the, the uh, Eric the Banner Hulk. Oh, well. Yeah, that, that one. Well, yeah, the yeah, but he also Hulk. directed Stinking Dragon, Smoking Tigers. Hidden... Um, hidden Burger King. Burning Bush, Hidden Penis. Yes. Hidden so, McDonald's, Striking Burger King. Sure. Okay, yep. Whoppers. Anyway, so <laughs> Gemini Man came out last weekend. I went to see it. I I quite enjoyed it. I wasn't expecting much. I was just expecting an entertaining. Million. It was a big budget. Like you could tell that they spent a lot of money because they fucking well, de-age Will Smith for half the goddamn movie. Yeah, well, it's also it's a ton of CGI the entire time. Right? I heard they did not de-age him. I heard that they did something completely different. They did a new technology where they actually laid a um, CGI skin over him. That's de aging in a different way. No. So, it's so not. is this like a new technology and practical effects? Yeah. I, uh, no, just a new, totally digital effect that no one's ever. Oh, okay, really so tried it's still before. digital. So, one hundred percent digital. Okay. L- let me go into the numbers first before I go into my review. So, worldwide, so far in two you weeks, you better do this quick, dude. Seventy-two million. So it's a bomb officially. Um, then Rotten Tomatoes, the tomato meter is twenty-five percent. Yeah, twenty five percent. But the audience score is eighty four percent with almost forty five hundred. Did they reviews. review bomb Will Smith and give him a positive? Yeah. So the critic consensus is Gemini's man. Impressive visuals are supported by strong performances. Gemini's men. Sci- Gemini men's. Gemini's men. But this men. sci-fi thriller is fatally undermined by a frustratingly subpar story. Uh, I kind of agree, but it's definitely not a twenty five percent movie. It's like a solid B. It's like, a solid B. That's 84% there, bitch. So that, the problem, the main problem of this movie was it's ahead of its time technologically. Wow. This movie was shot in 120 frames per second. Which people oh. don't like to look at. Yeah. It's not, not necessarily to the human eye. No. It's not pleasing to the human eye. We, I, you have 100 years of frame of what? What's the normal frame rate for, for movies? Um, 24. 24 frames per second is what film was originally done in. So they've been shooting that for even, over 100 years. Even even YouTube standard is 30 frames per second. And that is, looks it's, off. Yeah. And it, you shoot it. it. It's the same reason the hot, people hated the Hobbit. Hobbit. Because the Hobbit was at 48 frames per second. I thought it was at 60. No? No. no. no 60, 60 frames per second is what TV, sitcoms, sports, stuff like that is. If you see something in slow motion, it was done usually 60 frames per second. 120 frames per second is when is you're going to do redonk. slow motion. My cameras will do 120, but the only time I use that is when I'm doing super slow motion. So are you sure this was shoot, shot at 120? 100%. Yeah. There was, th- there's only... How th- much slow motion was there? I, 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 I mean, there was slow motion a little bit, but the thing was, there's 12 theaters in the country that showed it in its intended format. Oh, okay. Only 12. Literally 12 so theaters. So they're trying to... It's interesting because it's Edward- still There's also still a problem. Even though, even if you take 120 FPS and, and encode it down to 24 FPS for your standard movie theater quality, it's still doesn't really look right there's well, still something there's something about that's still going to make you feel queasy well here's an interesting point that edward norton made about scorsese and aniston who are like trashing like they were trashing the mcu and like how how like why people aren't going to movies and edward norton blamed movie theaters because he's like as a person who makes movies when i go to see a movie that was shot in a certain aspect ratio or was shot at a certain frame rate and the theater doesn't show it there and the theater's not clean and doesn't do it. He's like, theaters are responsible for this. They're not clean. They don't go out of their way. The what ones that do a good job. To? 
The ones in downtown LA, I'm sure. Probably very true. But what I'm saying is, like, if you go to a nice theater, those all seem to be doing good, but it's the crappy ones that are are struggling. The ones with, you know, here you, you hear about all the, what, the drinking theaters? Those are all doing really good. They're not oh, closing. Oh, yeah, the movie taverns and stuff. So where you make it an experience where people want to go, people will go and see it. But if you don't, people won't. Or if you're a noob noob and you just get blinded by Will Smith's glory, you oh, go, God. I love it. He looks good, old and young. How did it look with them? Th- why were they throwing um, bikes at each other? That seemed kind of ridiculous. Uh, they were just fighting. Just, just sibling, throwing bicycles yeah. at each other. The So, the, okay, let's go into my review real quick. Uh, a really quick review was a fantastically... And tech- I've spent... Yeah, technological marvel. And it's ahead I'm of its, spent. It's ahead of its time. Fantastic action movie. The story kind of crumbles towards the and end. And I've had enough. Okay. Who is the girl who is in it? Mary Elizabeth Winstead. Yes. She's cute as fuck. Uh, Super cute. Uh, I get, uh, Scott, what number would you give her? Here's another great review from it because there was a cute girl in it huh i mean he likes everything but let's get down to that i Notice like he only I likes like cute girls what she look girls? like who what is she they say? look like boys who is she? no Elizabeth no Winstead. ah i forget she's, she's, like a boy. what's she do she, you remember the boyish looking girl in um what's the movie scott pilgrim scott pilgrim she's uh, cute there too she looks kind of oh, like was, a she, was she the lead she was the lead yeah, with the, the blue haired ever 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 she changed changing color hair yeah blue haired dude i mean girl yeah, she was cute. Yeah, she's I. When, when she looked like a girl. When she looked like a girl. I she's mean, cute. as a lady boy, on the other hand. Lady boy, then Not she's so a 10. Much. She's a 10 on the lady boy scale. Hmm. Noob Noob loves the shit. lady boys. No, I love Noob cute Noob girls. That's what I like. Boys. She's a lady boy. Ever since Noob Noob hey. got tapped with that iPhone, he's been in kinds of weird shit. Nope, that's not it. Weird. I'm into the cute ones. That's weird. kind of strange. I have high I'm standards. confused. Particularly high You're standards. Very strange. Anyway, so I I would say I recommend. Why are we Gemini still talking Man. about this? Go see it, motherfucker. Okay, thanks. Yeah, I w- I would have loved to seen it no. in its true format. Next. Anyway, so let's let's spend two sentences on this review of two sentence horror story. I like horror movies. I you see them in theaters. Should skip it. Okay, is it on Netflix? That was one sentence. Yes. You need a second. Oh, uh, hold on. Let me think about it. Um, Horror movies aren't filmed in 120 frames per second. No. You still shouldn't see it in the movie theater. This is not... This is a Netflix. You it's still two shouldn't see stories. it on Netflix. Uh, it was... Made me feel awkward. So I don't like... Me no like. I so, felt awkward. Me no like. Netflix exclusive... Two sentence horror stories. Don't watch. Me no like. Okay. Do you have anything on it? What? No. Any, <laughs> not even, like it's that. not even worth. There was like a. I don't know. There's like I don't even know how many episodes there were. I watched the first episode and I was like, yeah, I'm done. <laughs> I bailed. I'm out. How many episodes? How do, often do, do you I know, bail do you know on how things? How many episodes? No, because I bailed. You bailed. There was like this guy. Here's the horror. Here's the setup. Tell me if you're horrified. There's a guy who only likes to date women who are good moms. That's terrifying. <laughs> oh, 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 I'm scared already. That's, that's terrifying. And then he finds a woman who has a fake baby. I mean, that actually is like a real story. <laughs> <laughs> this, this, is, this could be like written in fact. So I was like, yeah, I'm out. Check, please. Check. And they're tur- Hello, and is they're- anybody here going to uh, give me a check? And they're turning I this into out. a horror story? No, I went out. Give me. And this this two sentence story was it was it was no good. You, there's more horror story in that story that came out where the the, the 75 year old woman was pretending to be an adopted daughter, <laughs> like you, the orphan turned into real life. You heard about that, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It was real life. There yeah, was a the, real Czechoslovakian woman orphan. who was like yeah. 23, pretending to be like I think she, wasn't 12? she like 27 or 20? She pretending was, to be 12. She was almost 30, pretending so, to be 12 yeah, years old. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Sexy. So let's move on. <laughs> and the real meat and potatoes of this show, right? Well, I mean, maybe. We're I still guess. going? So I mean, the, I've, an, I've been done like fuck two another hours. Another Netflix exclusive was El Camino, a Breaking Bad story. El Camino. Yes. So this is the story of Jesse Pinkman. Is this our last review? It is our last review. Okay. Yeah. So well, if you like what I heard here tonight, go nope. over to Instagram. And nope. No. Uh, no. We're still. We still have to talk about this. I yes. tried. 
You tried, but you failed. Dum de dum, dum de dum dum dum. So it's a Netflix exclusive Breaking Bad movie. And, and as somebody who didn't see Breaking Bad either, should I care? Breaking mm, Bad was the if shit. If you didn't see Breaking Bad because you didn't see one of the best uh, television shows ever created. People said the same thing about that um, that Game of Tones thing. And it I, was good I, until I, the I season. haven't seen that either. Yeah, but people would tell you that it was good up until and the I season. And I still didn't watch it. Did you ever watch? Have you ever watched any of the greatest shows on television? Did you yes. ever watch Cheers? Yeah. All I saw of it, like though? one or two episodes. Okay. So, that was, did you ever that watch? was before my time. Oh, okay. Did you ever watch Sopranos? No. Yeah, me either. No, because people told me I need to watch it, so I didn't watch it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Ooh, so Scott. let's get to the Scott's review. Scott's a great reviewer yeah, here. No, he sucks. <laughs> so this is a follow-up to the Breaking Bad verse. You are fake news. Season, season five <laughs> on AMC. So uh, I did not get to watch this yet, but Z did. So oh, let's, let's, did. Hear, let's hear some things. Um, it's a lot of fan service. Basically, anyone who ever made a cameo in the show or had like some sort of like role that impacted Jesse Pinkman was in it. So his parents were in it. His shady Pete Didn't and this guy get Badger into were in drugs it. because he was dying. That that's was the, Walter White. That's Walter White. Yeah, that's not Jesse. Did Pinkman. he die? Walter White, yes, died. Spoiler. Uh, spoiler. Although we already knew that. Sorta. No. Well, they confirm that Walter White is in fact dead. Yes, but you didn't confirm it until this movie. What do you mean? They already... F- you watched him die. He's Lies. Th- the show ended like three years ago. It's over. It's done with. It's done. You but finished. He's, he's still in in flashbacks. In one flashback. And so is Mike Ehrmantraut. It's good enough. He gets one flashback. Guess who else is in this? How'd he die? Kristen... Ritter. How'd she die? Oof. How did she die? Do yes. you really want to know? Spoiler alert of Breaking Bad. She didn't know. Oh, she no, no. owed. She was overdosing on drugs, and Walter White had the opportunity to like turn her over so she didn't like choke on her own vomit, and he let her die. She was Jesse Pinkman's girlfriend. Wow, dude's an asshole. Yes, he is. Um, they confirmed Ooh, a couple other people died too. The animal. Did you feel the animal? Uh, there's so, no new information to this though. Like it doesn't add anything to the Breaking Bad story. The one thing that it does do is give Jesse Pinkman some closure because at the end of Breaking Bad, he's just escaping, and you're like, "What happens to Jesse?" Well, if you really cared, this is what happens to Jesse. So, am I bleeding? If you're a yes. hardcore fan of Breaking Bad, your eyeball is clearly bloody. You should show it right to the camera. I Scratch myself or something in the balls? Yes. No, in my fucking face. No. So, El Camino. I'm trying to curse nope. a lot less on episodes. Am I? How am I doing? Fuck Not, shit. I just, balls. I just cursed there. I know you did. Fuck am, fuck. am I doing better? No. Like I, 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 I was actually trying this episode. I don't shit. think you were. I, I was. I wasn't. I didn't curse as much as I have been. Cock, cock goblin. As much. I have, have, have to go back with a clicker. And over see. under 10? Over under? Over under 10. I just fucking cursed like five fucking times. Him, I say not under you, minutes. stupid. I say under. No this way. Episode. You are way over 10. Oh, yeah, because new new molested me. Yes. That definitely. That def- you were don't, way over 10. That's it. I'm, out. I'm done. I'm over. I'm done. I'm out. I'm, done. I'm out. Yes. I'm out. I'm over here. Who's going to do oh, Scott's God. plug at the very I'm end? So I'm going to finish the episode over here. Okay. Oh, yeah, my yeah. God. I, I'd give weird. you a place to lean, but this is I don't weird. Know. So you would recommend it I'm for a Breaking it. Bad fan? If you're a Breaking Bad fan, absolutely watch it. If you're not, you're going to not get anything of what's going on. I watched all Breaking Bad, and I barely understood everything that was going on. So, Okay. Well, I, I will say uh, there's one thing to point out, and uh, the actor... Uh, who's the actor who died? That doesn't help me. It, it Who died in real did life? Breaking Bad. Yes, he did. Uh, God, you're going to make me look this up, stupid? I mean, if only someone here had the internet and could look up things no, like this. No, I shut down my shit. As if they could actually do their job. No, there's still something there. Eh. Eh. Breaking... Bad actor that died. There could be multiple actors that died. No, he just died like a couple days ago. Mm, Did he really? Yes, he did, you piece of shit. Robert Forster. Who was he? He's a great actor. Um, He plays the guy who was smuggling. He tried, he smuggled um, Saul out. Oh, oh, was he in fucking Platoon? 
He was the platoon dude, right? Hold on. I'm going to tell you what was he was he in. Was he in Saul? I did not see Saul. Did you see Saul? Yes. I saw Saul see. He was in Jackie Brown. He was in Twin Peaks. Was he in Platoon? He was in Mulholland Drive. Was Olympus he in Platoon? Fallen. Shut the fuck up. Was he in Platoon? He was in the Delta Force. What about Platoon? With Dude, he was in a Chuck Norris movie. That's all that matters. No, was he in Platoon? That's all that matters. Was he the motherfucker in Platoon? No, he, I, I don't think so. Scroll down to Platoon. What are you talking about? He was is he in not. Platoon? He's, he's Show not. Show me the picture no. of him. Show you are so picture. stupid. Show me I'm going to punch you in the face. Show me, daddy. No. Yes. Was he in Platoon? He's pretty much in Platoon. Are we sure Hold he's on. in? Nope. He's in Platoon. Are you sure? How, I don't. How would you know? Because you didn't say fucking platoon look it again. up. Say Platoon again. Don't make me turn off your goddamn mic. Toon Platt? Was he in Toon Platt? Dude, if he wasn't in Platoon, you, you don't get to talk for the rest of the episode. Oh, no, that's God. not true. If no, only, I don't agree. I don't agree. Oh, that would be amazing. Please tell me he wasn't in I'm just going to get Dragon Ball Z references in there. Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball Z. someone else ha- no, can't do their job. No, Dragon Ball Z. No, 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 Useless. No? Okay. No, Ready? God! No, God, please, See? no! No! You, you, you mess no! with Z, he's got all the power. No! No, God! Okay, so let's look at his thing here. And he was in... Hold on. Why did you, why did you smirk when I said that? Still, still with that iPhone That's stuff. Weird. I don't... I know. I, you're making me look this up, and it's really irritating. I, do, I I need to, to, do I need to wrap this up? This dude's been in so many... Why don't you start wrapping it I mean, up while I look at this up? Go ahead and Before wrap this wrap up. It up we need to do a special Just wrap it up, Scott, because... Planet Manny. No, oh wait, I have to turn your microphone back on? Oh, my microphone's not on? No, it was off the whole time. You're a piece of yeah, you, shit. Your microphone's been off like Has it really? Oh, yeah. fuck all of you. So Planet Manny, one of our devoted Instagram followers and listeners, he, he likes to correct to, us. He loves to criticize. Because he's an asshole. Is he devoted or committed? He's an asshole he is what he is. He should be committed. But so, he does have a whole planet named after him, so yeah, maybe he has more power than he we He has do. an asshole the size of a planet. And <laughs> oh, um, oh, I love you, Manny. Wow. I want to eat your children in a good <laughs> I'm way, eat not, your a, babies. not a weird way. You're so eat he likes to correct us when we fuck up because we fuck up all the time. This no, past instance, uh, we kept saying the Joker movie when it's not really called the Who's Joker. This wee shit? What is there wee. a mouse in your pocket? I feel like we all we said all did it, it at yeah. least once. So it's actually called Joker, not the Joker. It's not the Joker movie. It's just Joker. And then I made a comment uh, about a Talladega Nights reference about spider monkeys and Mountain Dew. And the motherfucker knew the exact quote and quoted me right back the exact one because I apparently fucked that up too. Like I fuck up everything in my life. So we're going to start doing like a work you apology. Robert we Forster should. is definitely not in that movie. Not in Maybe you're thinking of Tom Berenger or mm. William Defoe. Maybe Keith David or Forrest Whitaker, but not definitely Michael. not Robert Forster. Definitely so. not Michael Keaton either. So, or anyway, Q apologizes. Yes. That's, Planet Manny is the best. The new segment. We would all hold him down and forcibly eat his dick. We're going to have to do a completely new episode for every time we have to do an apology. Yes. Every episode, it should because have at least one I think we're apology. done. We, we're we good. We could fill an entire episode we're good. with apologies. Scott, just r- write us off. So, if you like what you heard here this week, go over to Instagram and follow us at orc underscore you. That's O-R-K underscore you. Go to YouTube.com slash our reviews. No, 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 no. They go to Facebook.com slash our reviews will kill you to find stuff there. No, 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 no. You can go to YouTube and search our reviews will kill you. Can you explain what we're doing in YouTube? Info there. Now, on YouTube, we're doing the Orc You Quickies, where we're taking minute or so clips from every episode and just releasing them in individual segments to make share them make them viral quick easy to Consume. digest clips of our views will kill you share it give it to your friends show your mother she'll love it i swear so go to youtube and search our views will kill you and find stuff there we're still figuring out if it's gonna be a channel or not eh, semantics and of course, as always, Orc U is brought to you for free. Thanks to our friends over at ScoutWillKillYou.com. Yes, at ScoutWillKillYou.com, you'll find video content. And of course, the store where you will get the Noob Noob Pillow? Noob Noob Pillow? The Nilo. The special. If you, noob, I swear, okay, if pillow. you take yes. a picture you can of go. you and the Noob Noob Pillow, 
we will give you some ridiculously amazing we'll come prize. up with something i will if, I, if you yes if you send us a promise picture we'll make it worth I will, your while out of my pocket i will pay for something impressive it could be and something fun. awesome like booze or i don't anything. know anything depending if, if we you, can ship it to you we might not be able to ship you booze but we'll try to find something awesome to send to you if you send us a picture of you and the noob noob pillow i will send you something that will spectacular cost up to or more the cost of that noob noob pillow it will At be least, something I'd say good 50 dollars. absolutely absolutely I'm i will i'm in we will all take money from noob noob's pocket <laughs> and buy <laughs> something buy for special like 50 bucks and Seriously. definitely send it to you send this a picture of you and the noob noob pillow that would be incredible absolutely so yes go to scottwillkillyou.com and follow us and luck look stuff there go to the store anyway because scott will kill you in general <sighs> in general i'm exhausted oh well I don't know the word. Just end it. Well, we love y'all. Just end it. We love you. My throat hurts. I love y'all. A lot. We love y'all. Hey there, Orc Universe, Scott here, telling you to go ahead and click that subscribe video. Make sure you get all the Orc U videos as they're released. Click that like button, give us some love, and go down and comment. Tell us what you think, tell us what you loved, and of course, tell us that you hate Noob Noob. Hey, you may even get an extra surprise and a visit from somebody very special. Naked Scott. What are you doing here? Surprise, I can appear anywhere at any time. Isn't that illegal? Never you mind, Hollywood Scott. I'm here to remind our friends to go over to Scott Will Kill You Productions and go to Legion of Lunacy for more crazy videos and get more Orky Review videos by clicking on that link right over there. Why am I the one who's covered up? Shouldn't you be censored? You can't censor this, baby. I'm way too sexy. <laughs>